You've got to have a good imagination for this, I'll yes. tell you right at the this start. This is not actually yeah. a really a rubber yes, ball. The, yes, it's not a rubber ball, nor is it a very bad copy of Mickey Mouse, <laughs> no. uh, despite the ears. Uh, it's a cell, and your body's made of lots of cells, and viruses basically are genetic programs. They're like a computer program that reprogram the computer. In this case, the computer is the cell. So the, if the virus gets inside the cell, it reprograms the cell to make lots and lots of copies of virus, and then it kills the cell, so the viruses can get out and infect more cells. That's why viruses make you sick. They kill cells inside your body. So, of course, for the virus to deliver its computer program, it's got to get inside the cell. So the virus, here is our virus. It's not to scale. Uh, here's one I made earlier, as they say, except I didn't. It was made by RIS. Uh, but viruses, basically, are very simple. They're not alive. They're dead. They're, they're, they're just a bit of material, but the point is they can program the cell, which is alive. So the virus has to get inside the cell, and so it binds onto a receptor on the surface of the cell. So the cells have a lot of proteins on their surface whose job it is to signal to other cells, and viruses hijack that process by finding that they can fit into the receptor like that. Okay, so then now that virus would now be taken inside the cell by the same machinery as the cell uses to take food and stuff into itself. So if we want to stop that happening, what we need is something which covers up the bit on the virus that can bind onto the receptor. Now, in our body, we have these things called antibodies. They're proteins in your blood, and you all have them. And they're all different because they're designed to bind against different things. So if we have a vaccine or if we get an infection, we'll make an antibody that's specific for the cause, the virus. And the antibody works by binding onto the surface of the virus and blocking the bit that would normally go onto the receptor. So here we've got an antibody raised by a vaccine against this virus. It coats the virus all over the surface, and the virus can't get inside the cell anymore. Simple. 